Hi guys. So today we have decided. Oh, sorry, trying to move the camera. There we are. So today we have decided to spontaneously vlog. <laughs> spontaneously <laughs> vlog our um, day because it's such a beautiful day today. It's been such nice weather. We've been spoiled. So we thought we're going to head to Crystal Palace Park, which is one of our favourite parks in London. We thought we'd take you along with us and show you the sights of Crystal Palace Park. Let's go! Oh, hey. Hey. <laughs> oh, oh, no. Bit more about the dinosaurs. How do you say that one? What one? Plesiosaurus. Plesiosaurus. Ichisaurus. Labyrinthodon. Dicenodon. You can tell the ones that they've redone recently. Oh, yeah, they had the dino doctors out. And so some of them are newly painted <laughs> <laughs> pigeons. <laughs> You're walking right into them. It's like that scene from Home Alone 2. <laughs> she feeds all the pigeons and she feeds all the birds. And then they attack. They've had a fresh lick of um, dino paint. That one hasn't. That one's still a bit grey. But these ones have. I love this part, but it is so random that there's just dinosaurs in the middle of it. That one. That one's had lots of paint. Look at the size of this guy. He's a megalosaurus. He's a what? A megalosaurus. <laughs> <laughs> Meaning a giant lizard. He does look like a giant lizard. It's um, teeth were compared to knife saws and saws. Terrifying animal loomed large in popular culture. And writer <gasps> Charles Dickens imagined meeting one. An iguanodon. If anyone's been to Animal Kingdom. Isn't that the dinosaur we save? An iguanodon. Inguanodon? I, I got that know. wrong. I don't know. We'll and have they're to like, double check they're that. like, save the. It's something similar. Do we save an iguana done in Disney? The scanner built into the rover picks up a big dinosaur, and Seeker thinks that it might be an iguanodon. Well remembered. Yep. You know your Disney. <laughs> be crazy if they just like came to life. I'd <laughs> be terrifying. <laughs> <laughs> Especially as we're near the mean looking ones. <laughs> Those guys look nicer. Oh, little babies. And the mum. These hmm. little guys run away. Hmm. Going it alone. Enjoying your day at Crystal Palace Park? It's such a nice park. I love the park. I don't know if I'd go as far as Helena. <laughs> Helena's saying that this reminds her of Animal Kingdom in Disney. It's got the dinosaurs, the nature. It's, it's, it's okay, it's not it's not animal kingdom, but it is very nice. I want the rides. <laughs> oh, the, the, the boats are open. Oh, they are. It's a huge park as well, and I, I kind of feel like people don't realise it exists as much. Nah. Because it's a bit further out of central London. Yeah. Um, South east. But, but if, I would definitely visit it. Yeah, if you're, if you're down south park, and it's a really sunny day. You've got definitely. dinosaurs, you've got a maze, pedal boats. Yeah, just loads of nice places. Sound like to have I'm advertising it, yeah, but I do really like it. <laughs> <laughs> I sort of want to go on a boat, but I don't have any cash. I feel like we'd fall in. No. <laughs> we just saw the word sloth. So mega megatherium. 
which is this fella here. He's a huge ground sloth. He was the size of an elephant. Oh, oh the model gosh. once lost its left arm after a tree the grew limb. too wide and the limb snapped off. Oh, but that's like real sloths. They, um, because they're moving so slow and going through the tree, they sometimes mistake a branch for their arm. Yeah. So they'll think that their arm's a branch, go to grab it and then fall down. And if you want to see it, it's over here. I love sloths. <laughs> As everyone knows. No, nobody knows that. <laughs> they will. They will come to uh, know my obsession. You can't really see him. Um, let me know if anyone else is a sloth, lo sloth lover. That sounds like a sloth lover. If you're a sloth lover, <laughs> then get in touch. Let I'll us know your, if you've I'll been. I'll be your friend. <laughs> if you've been to the sloth sanctuary in Costa Rica. Yeah. Oh, I can't really see it. I have to go around the other side. Do you think you could sign a consent form to be in my video? Next on our model search, Irish elk. What is it? Giant deer. And it's over here. Oh, there's one there, hidden. Oh, yeah. It's like a Patronus. <laughs> is it actually? Slightly bigger. Geeky Harry Potter knowledge. <laughs> We've never done this, but you can get these little pedal boats and if you want to know when and how much then here's the info. <laughs> Helena just asked the question everybody is probably thinking how many people fall in? Because I, I feel like I'd fall in. <laughs> <laughs> well, unfortunately it's not open today. <laughs> so you don't get to see us falling. <laughs> the sun's gone in a bit, which is nice. It's nice actually. With the breeze, we decided to stop and have our little picnic. Yeah. So what do we got? Right, so I went for... <laughs> it's not a proper picnic if you don't have a sandwich, but I'm trying to avoid bread, so I've got... Sushi. Iced tea. And grab bag hulus. Hoops are all this size now. <laughs> They're Nowadays. big. Nowadays. I was wondering. Am I just old? Because are they all the, these huge ones now? I'm glad they're big though, because I'm able to do something I used to do when I was a kid. Put them on your fingers and then eat them off. Why do you have two bigger hands when you were little? <laughs> no, it's because if, if I did it now with the small hula hoops, I don't think they'd fit on my hand. <laughs> so they've made the hula hoops bigger for adults? For me. Oh, I just do they make the little ones anymore? I don't know. No, I do. It's just these are a bigger. These are big. Huge. These are big hoops. Mm. That's all. Right. So we just had a bit of a lie down on the grass. Is that you taking grass off your back? And mm. <laughs> <laughs> um, we're about to go for a bit of a wander. Go do the maze. And there's this like really. There's this old empty stage that I want to show on the camera. I think it would be great for performances, but it's very derelict, isn't it? I, I think they're hoping to redo it. Redo it up, though. Oh, is that what you read? Yeah, and become like a fringe theatre oh, yeah. theater fringe place. That'd be cool. Just while I remember, I just wanted to say thank you to David Christopher Brown, my mate Dave. <laughs> the official name. Well, I wanted to say that because his full name comes in the, the podcast oh, okay. title. <laughs> yeah, so I did a podcast with Dave. Uh, it's a podcast that I do called Creativity Talks. Uh, he came around the other day. You may know him from YouTube, vloggers Sophie and Dave. Uh, he's got his own uh, Dave Does Weight Loss YouTube channel and we just talked about everything. Talked yeah, about all my favourite things. Musical theatre. Musical theatre, Disney, Edinburgh Fringe, yeah. YouTube. The podcast itself was about 50 minutes, but we chatted for like an hour before we started and then an hour after. It could have gone on for ages. Yeah. Uh, just I'm sure really you've all probably listened to it, but I'll definitely put the link below for anyone that missed it. Yeah. Um, because it's really good, really good listen. Especially if you're like driving to work or driving to school or yeah, just commuting. anywhere or commuting in general. 
But yeah, so thank you very much. And also thanks to Sophie and Dave for the shout out on their yeah. channel as well. We love you guys. And if you've not subscribed to them, just head on over and click the subscribe button. Yeah. Right. They're awesome. And they've just recently been to Disney World. Oh yeah, they were great. So that was, they were, those props were awesome. And getting us very excited for our trip. <laughs> oh yeah, more to come on that. Yeah, so <laughs> thanks Sophie, thanks Dave. This is everything that's included. And we're here. That's what Please. I want to show. It's called the Concept Bowl. The Concept Bowl is over there. We'll go through the maze first. This reminds me of Alice in Wonderland. Disney again. The maze. Disney again. <laughs> it's quite a like old fashioned maze though. Like, look at it. It's quite eerie. Yeah. We made it out of that one in Longleat, the uh, Arthur one, so we should be okay. That's if you uh, get scared and you've got to escape. Right, left or right? Last time we went right and it didn't work out too well, did it? How do you remember? I think, yeah, I think I remember going right. Okay, let's go now. Like someone gave up and they just thought, nah. I'm gonna make my own way out. Let's break out. <laughs> Still not money. Unless, are, they, are they meant to be? No, that's just someone's broken no, it. No, that's just, yeah, someone's broken that. Yeah. We've just gone one way at the minute. It's like all one way since we started. Left or right? Uh, right. making quick decisions here. <laughs> I don't think this is the day in boiling hot sun to do this. <laughs> Does it lead to a... Squirrel. <laughs> squirrel! <laughs> oh we, look, there's we, a squirrel. Do we win a prize? No, nah, I don't think so. Ah, I think there's two letters. So not only can you not find your way out, but you get stung <laughs> along the way. Does it lead to an ice cream man in the middle? Where are we now? No, this is where we this is where we came in, isn't it? You chose that Just way. before? Should we go back that way? Well, we can head this way. Okay. Is this not where we walked? Oh. It's so close. This is really promising. We might have done it all in one go. No dead end. No dead end. It's over there. Oh no. No, we're going away from here. We were just we were right there, and now I'm getting really hot and sweaty, getting stressed. We've been in here for about eight minutes now. This way or this way? My choices aren't working. Go on, you, okay. You decide. I'm gonna go further away for sure. Like <laughs> you are? I think someone's changed this. <laughs> I think they've moved the um <laughs> When we got close we should have just climbed over the bushes. <laughs> That's cheating. <laughs> I wonder how many steps we've done. <laughs> Too many. <laughs> There's the. <gasps> Escape gate. Oh. <laughs> we made it. We're alive. <laughs> that wasn't too bad then. <laughs> we didn't do too badly. Work. Sweaty. If anyone um, has come or been here and has done the maze, let us know your times. <laughs> we should have done that. Oh well, no, we've got it on. The... Hang I on, think... it is. Oh, it was about ten minutes. 
That's bad. Ten minutes. See if you can beat us. Did you do it it's in probably. under ten minutes? Very easy. Yeah. So this is what I said I wanted to show you. It looks like it'd be good for performances. Look at it. Although, at the moment, if you fell off the stage, you'd fall into a swamp. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you might think that's grass, but it's not. I don't want to get too close. I'm not going to get too close because knowing me, I probably would fall in. But <laughs> it's not. Don't drop it's... the camera in. What is it? Oh, is it swamp? No, it's grass. That's not grass. It's a swamp, isn't it? Yeah, it's a swamp. You can tell. Oh, yeah, it is. It's glistening, but it looks like grass. It looks like you're right. It's track, isn't it? It's like where Shrek lives. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like the swamp where Not Shrek Disney lives. Not Disney this time. Dreamworks. <laughs> okay, I think that's going to conclude our walk around, isn't it? We're yeah. gonna We're going to head back we're gonna, home. We're going to head back, grab some ciders. And yeah. um, you've got your, our friend coming around. Yeah, <laughs> I'm doing a wrestling podcast with my friend Bobby. So we'll introduce you to Bobby. Yeah. I've got a question for you. What? Do you fancy running up those steps? Struggling to walk in the heat. <laughs> Maybe not then. I'm meant to be um, running a 10k next Sunday. This Sunday. Yeah, oh, should, should this... I vlog it for you? Yeah, you can do it actually. <laughs> I'm just I'm doing Race for Life. Um, I'll pop the sponsor um, page down below. But um, yeah. Meant to be uh, running a 10k in this heat. Hopefully it cools down because I'm struggling to walk. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Not gonna lie. <laughs> Can you still donate once it's yeah, finished? Yeah, 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 yeah. Because yeah, because this will go out after you've done it. Oh yeah, it will do actually. Yeah. So yeah, yeah, you can still still donate after. Yeah, for a great cause. And I'll yeah, if I'm there, <laughs> hopefully I'll be there. I don't know if I'll be working yet, but if I'm not, yeah, I'll go along You'll and vlog it. for you. <laughs> You'll probably be Kill like. Me. No. Struggling. Yeah. <laughs>
couple of weeks later than this episode was on but at the moment I'd say my favourites are Camilla and Marcel but it could all change but at the moment I think they're my favourites Camilla's just so sweet and Marcel's a real good guy so yeah I'm gonna watch Love Island chill out try and keep as cool as possible thanks so much for watching um i hope you enjoyed this random vlog but it's been fun i've enjoyed taking my camera out with me today and then next week will be a very exciting vlog so i'm gonna do a disney packing video because we're going to disneyland paris in a week and a bit's time which i'm very excited for and we're gonna vlog it all I'm going to do a big vlog series um, of Disneyland Paris and I haven't been since I was about 10 years old so I'm really really looking forward to that. Uh, so we're going to do a Disney packing video next week and also my boyfriend's going to do um, what to bring if you're driving in France because they've got quite a long list of things that you need to bring in your car so that video might be useful for anyone that's going to Disneyland Paris and driving or anyone that's um, just going to uh, France. Very, very exciting. So thanks for watching. Please subscribe and like, and we will see you very soon. Bye. Oh.